Hello everyone, welcome back to one of Oracle DBA tutorial. In today's uh, tutorial, we're gonna run how to automate Arman backup using shell script. So this video is all about the Oracle database backup and how to automate our backup. So in a real environment, of course, you will not manually trigger all of Oracle database backups. You need an automated mechanism to trigger Armand backups. So in this topic, we will learn how to set Armand backup automatic using shell script. So first, create directory for your backup. So on, on your database server, create a directory to hold Armand backups and all related files. All the Armand backups, logs, and backup scripts are kept in one directory. So to make a directory for your backup, so I am going to create this directory. So this is my database server. And as you can see, my database is running here. OEM. My database name is OEM. So let's create a directory that we can store our backup here. So I'm going to create under user one backup and uh, let's say backup. What's the name of my database? OAM and today's date. Uh, what is today's date? Okay, we are in a new year. Happy new year to everyone. 2023, 24. I have created this uh, directory in order to store my backup. I should go here. And as you can see, I have nothing. Okay, once you have created your directory, create Armand backup script files. Let us create the Armand backup script file to trigger DB full backup. So we are going to create a full backup database. So login as root is your call and change your environment. So I have already done, but in your case, if you are not done, so once you have login with the root, change your user to Oracle and set the environment to the, your database or EM. Once you are done, okay, go to that directory that we have created. Okay, so which directory we have created? This one. Go to this directory, cd to this directory. Okay, we are going to create our script here. So I'm going to create a script using vi, vi full backup dot sh, vi full backup dot sh. Hold on, pwd. So this is the path we should use. Okay. Uh, let me take this to notepad. Okay. Notepad. So what you can do is run allocate channel so I'm going to use a channel which fast the performance of our backup, backup format. And this is the part that we just created. I have to change it. So this is the part that I have created to store my backup. I, I'm going to change it here. So backup format that directory and this is the database SQL alter system archive log current backup format and this is that path in directory archive log all and backup format and I have to change this as well current control file and release eight of the channel so what you can do is copy this go to here I'm going to create a script for vi full backup 
dot sh and i to insert and paste it as you can see okay okay run allocate channel to one okay something wrong okay we have all the script run okay once you have uh, paste it here skip button colon w q so our script is ready also give permission let's see okay the permission given to this okay now schedule backup under cron tab now the backup script is ready because I can I can run this script manually just by uh, by by setting my environment to my database and and the backup. So this way, if I run this is called manually. So you do it, but I don't want it. The system itself should do it. So that's why the concept is to automate Armand backup using shell script. So in order to automate your backup job, so what you can do is give permission to that uh, folder that we just created and that backup jobs. So let me see. Okay, change mode to this and copy all this directory as well as the script so this permission should be given once you did it then now you can go ahead and schedule the backup under the cron tab for example we are we are scheduling backup to trigger every thursday and friday at midnight so i want this backup job to be run every midnight of tuesday and friday in order to do that just simply type cron tab minus e cron tab minus e and then this is zero zero uh, zero zero ampersand ampersand friday tuesday because this is what we are going to run midnight every midnight of tuesday and friday and then specify the path of your arman script so in our case, that's totally different path, but I can change for you guys. Okay. Every midnight of Friday and Tuesday, and the path should be, let's check. This is the path for your script that you have to specify. Once you, you are ready, then go, Go ahead and type cron tab minus e cron tab minus e i to insert and copy this insert escape colon wq now this is going to take your backup your full backup every tuesday and friday at midnight so this is how you can automate your backup job in oracle database so i have a cron uh, cron tools here is a cron tool i use this is the 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 side so you can go here and type any time any days any uh, minutes that you want to run your job so make it ready here and use it for your script so i also a uh, cron job schedule syntax a basic cron tab entry looks something like this so first star is minutes you see here in our case was zero zero minutes zero hours zero hours zero day okay asterisk day of the month day of the month and asterisk uh, month of month from 1 to 12 okay and then friday tuesday midnights 
So zero zero is midnight. So this is how you can create your backup jobs automatically to run by the system. So now I don't need to worry about my backup jobs because I already have scripts for that. And this script is going to be run every Tuesday and Friday midnight. Uh, I have to read it. Yes. So this is my uh, Arman script that take full backup database, run allocate channel D1 type disk, and is going to take the database backup, is going to take archive log backup, is going to take control file backup. So I'm not going to run this backup jobs manually. So for that, I have created a cron, tab, cron job. So basically cron tab in this. So every Tuesday and Friday midnight is going to be run my backup jobs. So it's going to take my full backup jobs. So also for your reference, this is my website in top DBA. As you can see, HTTPS, AFGDBA, blogspots.com is my website you can refer and thank you for watching if you like my video please hit the like button also please make sure to subscribe because that's going to motivate me and also you will be the first one to be informed or updated from upcoming videos thank you guys for watching